Hey guys, I'm Tim. I'm Bob. I'm Spencer. I'm CJ. And this is the Board Game Rundown. Today, Spencer has brought in his Kickstarter, Steampunk Rally. This is like second edition, right? Fusion. Fusion. Yeah. Oh, Steampunk Rally Fusion. Thank you. Yeah. Uh, so we're going to unbox it real quick. Let's see what's inside. Mm -hmm. Hi, big boy. That's your game. Cracker open. So uh, that's the box like from the first game. This, yeah. is, this is the box from the first one. Yeah. Yeah. Steampunk Rally and Steampunk Rally Fusion is the special dual box. Yeah, it's got both of them because the, uh, the original box is half as thick. Half as thick. This is the Atomic Edition. This is uh, designed by Ugh. Oren Bishop and is a Roxley Games. Yeah. Okay. Roxley makes some good stuff. Uh, it Start. does appear that this has stopped being steampunk and has now moved on to, I believe that's Atom Punk. There's oh, gears. Yeah, probably. Oh, oh, there's gears? Okay. There are gears. No, this is Atom Punk now. <laughs> this is 1950s. Oh, oh, yeah. Nice. I love gears. So in this one, the, three, baby. the dice oh, is like dice energy type or what? Well, this is not a six-sided die. This is like a crazy... Whoa, that is not a six-sided oh, die. Well, it is six-sided, six. but the numbers don't start or, at one. Yeah, correct. Oh. It is not your typical six-sided die. What the heck? Oh, those Whoa. are cool. Yeah, those are the, like, the, the metal, money, the cogs. Metal cogs. I those are really cool. Yeah, metal cogs in yours. I, I do. Oh. And I, I supplement oh, look, it with some from work, sizes. too. Ah. <laughs> oh, beautiful. Can I, can I borrow some of these for 40K so I can They're very better? cool. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right. Oh, look. My six out of dice got me oh an my eight. Oh, my gosh. This insert's really nice, Spencer. It is really nice. I love those. Oh, nice wow. Did you back this, Bob? Oh. No. I have the original. Oh, so glad I, I play the original. This. I enjoy it. Stand, so. Stands for the guys. They didn't have minis, but you they know what? I think the cardboard's going to be just fine. Yeah. Nope. Stands work, especially the way that this game, because you're going to... Yeah, you use oh. standees. You do a modular board, mm -hmm. build yourself a racetrack, and then you draft cards, uh, and then you use those cards to either assemble your... Uh, contraption or you yeah. can discard them for uh extra dice or for I, cogs i see different legs of yep. here yep. Yep. apparently so you'll different put them together. Uh, ways of locomotion yep mm -hmm. i'm looking forward to this yeah it's super so. fun have you played the original one yet no no oh no, it's no. a lot of fun I it's, saw it's super all thematic this and i was like this is like right up my alley i really yeah. want to try this yeah it's, mm -hmm. I, it's I really enjoy it mm -hmm. and then these so. that tracks your damage and your uh, shielding. Yeah, this is definitely you build gone, up your shields. gone full atom punk now. Oh, yeah, I know it has. <laughs> We're like in Mars, actually. Yeah, this is Mars. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Uh, oh, mm. Particle beam? It's neat because yeah. like, you'll have <laughs> there's, like, different beam. types of uh, upgrades, right? You have like converters that change the element on it, or you have like upgraders. So you have like, oh, I can roll this one yellow dice, and that's going to give me extra red dice. And then you put all these pips oh. on your cards, and then uh, each round you'll have like a, a vent phase where you gotta psh, let all the steam back off, right? So you like power them up and add all the steam to them. You get all the locomotion out of them, everything, and then the next round you gotta start working your pips down to you know clear them off of your board to make room to be able to use it again. Oh. and I'd say that these are dual layer, but they're not really. But they're yeah, little nice. spin dials, yeah. They're, they're, they're kind of dual yep. little spin dials. Yeah, yep. they, they track your uh, your damage rude because you, you go to the negative, but then you can also repair that stuff so you don't have to lose parts How off rude. your machine. <laughs> oh, these are probably uh, Kickstarter Promo. bonus promos. Yeah, this yep. is the Kickstarter uh, 2020 promo Ooh, did you pack. get the, uh, look and see, there's uh, Back to the Future uh, oh, DeLorean. Oh, Doc Brown. Oh, yeah. yeah, oh, look, yep. Doc yep. Brown. Yep, Doc Brown. Ah. Dr. Morty. Now go, go there should be a DeLorean here somewhere. <laughs> oh, I love it. Oh, got, hey, look, got they him. got a biography of Alan Turing in here. Oh, wow, they got a, all the inventor biography. Yeah, yeah, oh, no, no. mistreated badly the by the government he covertly Full protected. Stock. That's putting it lightly. Hedy Lamar. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Hedy. Hedy. Yeah, Amelia Hedy. Earhart, of course. <laughs> Andre Sakharov. Maybe in a, you, you, yeah, Igor Sikorsky? So. Yeah. Oh, wow. These are cool. Yeah. Who else we got? Wow. Nikola Tesla. <laughs> oh, there he is. Uh, Mary Curie. Oh, who's on the, the backside. Yeah, yeah, yeah. DeLorean. George Washington Carver. Carver. There you go, Thomas guys. Edison. Or the Wright brothers. Yeah. Here's your DeLorean. Oh, yes, the DeLorean. <laughs> but we're going. We won't need roads. Okay, this is, this is great. I love yeah. this. Mm -hmm. Right? I kind of <laughs> like the DeLorean from Back to the Future 2. It runs on garbage. Yeah. Yes. I just eat garbage all day. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> all right, guys. So, uh, so this is uh, Steampunk Rally Fusion. Yeah. The uh, most recent iteration of this game from yep. Roxley Games. Mm -hmm. uh, I have only played it once. I need to play it again because I don't think I loved this the first time I played it, but mm -hmm. it was kind of like a learning game, and there's like six players. Yeah, it plays like, like up to eight, I think, it can hold. It was six like a to, lot of people. Eight. And we were and teaching. It does take a, a little bit, but yeah. So I... I don't want to really hold judgment on it based mm -hmm. on that experience because sure. I see the appeal and like I see this game and I'm like, 
like Spencer, like this game should be for me. It right. Be, yeah. So, uh, so yeah, yeah learning I, with six or eight people can take a while. It can be tough. So yeah. I, I will ask this though. Uh, let's talk availability. Is this available publicly at this point? Uh, I this? have no idea yet. I actually don't know if it's okay. available publicly. When it's, did you get this in the mail? I got this in the mail. I was one of the last people in the country to get this in the mail. I As got this usual. mail like a week and a half ago, and. I was one of the last 5% mm -hmm. of people in the country to get right. it when we pre-ordered it because of a shipping error. Mm. Well, that's all that's right. what you're going to do, right? That means a lot of times on Roxy Games, you can get on their website. But oh, it's, yeah, that's a good it's point. probably not available at your FLGS yet. Quite not yet. Not yet, but look for it. Yeah, check out their, uh, their website. Bug though. people for it. Roxy Games. They get some other good games, Yeah, because yeah, you know there's nothing more than... Uh, that people love other than getting bugged for stuff. They oh, absolutely. <laughs> hey, hey, you know what? <laughs> Ask your game stores. It generates buzz. Absolutely. Yeah, that's the way to do that's, it. And yeah, you're supporting your store. Thing. At the end of the day, that's that's what matters. Yep. Mm -hmm. So for the uh, Board Game Rundown, I've been Tim. I've been Bob. I've been Spencer. I'm CJ. We'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Thanks for checking out the Board Game Rundown. If you like what you saw, like, comment, and subscribe to our channel. Share our videos on social media and spread the word. We publish new content weekly, including reviews, unboxing, and Let's Plays. And as always, thanks for watching.